So we are out here today administering the National Odor Recognition Test. That's a test that ATF provides to our federal, state, and local partners throughout the country. We're out here to test these dogs to make sure that they can find basic explosive odors. And along the way, that we've also brought some new explosives out to make sure that they're proficient when they're out in the field protecting the public. So I have a team of canine trainers and a chemist with us. The canine trainers will take the, uh, the canine teams around these cans that you see um, work behind us and they're going to make sure that the dog can respond to every explosive odor that we have out there. Once they're proficient at it, we'll send them over to our forensic chemist who will administer the same test. Um, obviously the explosives are in different locations, but they will, she will administer the test and once they're proficient and they pass, then they get a certificate of proficiency and, um, and they're on their way. See if there was like a bomb threat or something, they would be calling one of these dogs that are here today. Some of these dogs, like our ATF dogs, are able to find shell casings. Some of them are, uh, can find guns, ammunition, different things like that. Uh, then you have also on the other side where there are narcotics dogs, and you know, obviously they're looking for illegal drugs. Uh, you have a cadaver dogs, which unfortunately are looking for, for bodies. And, um, and then you have patrol dogs, which are apprehension dogs. The, the most popular breeds for a detection dog are Labrador Retrievers and Belgian Malinois, which you, you, we have a lot of them here today. We have German Shepherds, we have Dutch Shepherds. Newest dog that people are training are German Short Hair Pointers. So yeah, we have a variety of dogs that are, are really good. And um, so far today, we have everybody that's taken the test has passed and, and we're, we're doing really good attempts to replicate what a detection dog can do and I, I really don't I'm not gonna go into you know what they are um, but this is one of the most proficient tools that law enforcement has to fight violent crime and to protect the public uh, their, their, their sniffing capability is amazing and that's why you see so many dogs here today is because they'll beat a machine every time when it comes to endurance, mobile ability to get in and out of things and up and over different things. So they're a great tool. You know, I've been lucky. I've been doing this since I was 19 years old and um, it's, it's a great job and um, all these guys love it.